Hey everyone, this is Julie from Gleeful Things, and in this video I'm going to show you how to slip knot, chain, and single crochet in rows. For this tutorial I'm going to be using Premier Eversoft, which is one of my favorite acrylic worsted weight yarns because it's really soft and shiny and it comes in a lot of pretty colors. This one's called Clover. I'm also using my Clover soft touch hook in a size H. To tie a slip knot, first find the end of your yarn, and then several inches from the end, twist the yarn around two fingers. Then pull a piece of yarn through to create a loop. Pull up on the loop to tighten it. Then if you need to make it smaller, you can pull down on the tail to adjust the size. Now you can slip your hook into the loop and we're ready to start chaining. To make a chain, wrap your yarn over the hook and pull it through the loop that was already on your hook. Every time you do this, it counts as one chain. Now you can single crochet in the chain that you just made. You're going to skip the chain closest to the hook and then insert your hook into the second chain. Wrap your yarn over the hook and then pull it through the chain so you'll have two loops on your hook. Then wrap your yarn over the hook once more and pull it through both loops. This is one single crochet. Once more. Insert your hook into the next chain. Wrap your yarn over the hook and pull it through the chain. Now wrap your yarn over the hook once more and pull it through both loops. Now you can continue making one single crochet in each chain until you get to the end. Alright, now that we're done with the first row, I'll show you how to do the second one. First, chain one and then flip it over. Insert your hook into the first stitch and make your first single crochet. And continue making one single crochet in each stitch all the way across.
If you want to keep practicing more rows, you can do them the same way that we did the second row. Thanks for watching. I hope this was helpful.